Hey guys, it's Pappy Kotrick, but you can call me Pappy. So we're here today answering 10 of the top questions that I get asked as a porn star slash OnlyFans content creator. I haven't read these questions yet, but let's see what they are. How big is your... I get asked this question a lot, actually. So... I've never actually measured it before. I get asked a lot. I don't want to measure it. What do you think about it? Should I just measure it? You tell me. Everyone else about there? Yeah. Good question. What is your job? I get asked this a lot as well. This is my job. Content creation. I'm on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. We're coming in hard, baby. OnlyFans, the content I create for OnlyFans, like so much time and effort goes into it. Oh, and Telegram. Am I missing something? What else am I missing? I don't know what else I'm missing, but let's move on to question three. Where are you from? So not many people know this. I get asked a lot. And because of my appearance, people are always saying Italian or no one knows where I'm from. I'm actually, I'm from, I'm Australian, born and raised in Australia. Dad's side of the family is Serbian, but I don't live in Australia. Question four, can you F me? I could. You've seen the videos. I know you know I could. The question, the real question to you is, could you take it? Question five, can you F my husband and me? I definitely think I could. But the question again is, could you both handle it? This is a fun one. Number six, an actually very common question I get. I'm straight. I've never been effed in the A and want to try it. Now this question, I'm always giving tips and tricks on how to get started. But I know what he really wants is a bit of the pappy. But pappy can't be everywhere all at once. So we're gonna be talking and discussing a lot about stretching and ways to get prepared for your pappy. Question seven, what do you prefer, men or women? I've never just been like, I like one or the other, blonde or brunette. I think it comes down to chemistry, that fling, that desire, the want, the need. So it depends. If you don't get that with a guy, it's not normally as good. If you don't get that with the girl, it's not normally as good. So really, keep your options open, keep your mind open, and don't stereotype like that, baby. Question eight, can we meet? I meet fans all the time. We get photos, videos, talk, chat. They tell me what's their favorite thing. I'm really humbled when I meet fans. I've met fans in the funniest places. I've met fans in toilets, in the planes, in shops, just in the street. Let's go to question eight. Do you ever bottom? Baby, your pappy likes what he likes and he does what he wants. I have tried it. I tried it. I can try it. I filmed a few videos. You can check them out if you really want. But I just knew it wasn't for me. I do know. I do know that I'm a top. Because when I tried that, oh baby, I had fun with that. <laughs> Question 10. How long have you been in the industry for? I feel like I've been in the industry for about a year. But it's been about four years. When I first started, it was just a lot of fun, a lot of photos. Pushing those boundaries. Boundaries on how much I shared and what sort of explicit content I would be sharing. And so babies. That wraps up the top 10 questions I'm asked, the porn star, almost daily some of these questions. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stick around for more. More questions, more pappy knowledge bombs, more sex education videos. Leave some comments below. I'll be reading them after this. Call me pappy.